Hello everyone, this is Saide. Welcome to the Textile Design with Photoshop. In this session, I'm going to teach you how to make a mapping of your design so it helps you to have a real uh, feeling of your design on the product that you design for that. I hope you enjoy watching this video and if you like, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much and have a good one. Before I start, I would like to introduce my Instagram page in Title Gillan Design. You can follow the page and see my design over there. And if you have any question regarding to each design and drawing process, ask me and send me a message. One of the most important subjects in textile design is mapping. That is placing the textile design into, a, into an image or photograph of the products. In this session, I'm going to show you how to place some textile design into a clothes and shoes. By doing this, your customer would have a real feeling about your design. So first of all, make a copy of your design by selecting all, then edit and copy, and then go to the page of the photo you have chosen and want to place the design and paste it there with Control v As you can see, the size of design is much bigger than the clothes here. To fix this, I click on Edit from Menu and select the Free Transform and dragging from right corner, make the design smaller and fit its size to the model. Here, to see the percentage of scaling the design, as you can see, it is 26%. Now, I delete the resize layer and go back to the design page. Then, click on image from menu and select image size. In the image size window, change the scale type to percent and make sure the width and height are linked together. And now change the size from 100 to 25%. Okay, we double click on hand icon on toolbar. The page is shown in the real size. The quality of the design would be much better if you change the scale of design independent page instead of doing this while transforming that to the mapping or model page. Now select all with Ctrl A in the page here and then copy it with Ctrl C and go back to the mapping page and click on quick selection tool from the toolbar and select the clothes that we want transfer design on that. Um, by holding Alt key, you can deselect the area that you don't need. So I did it here and here and here. With zooming, we can have a more accurate selection as needed. I think this is good enough. Now we can paste the design. So click on edit. 
and paste special then select the paste in tool here it click on move tool from the toolbar you can move the design in a clothes and put it in an appropriate place Now you can go to the layer window and select the multiply as your blending option. These blending options add a light and shadow on the design and makes more shadows are projected on the skirt and make it looks real and natural. As you can see, with the normal blending, it's completely flat, and by changing to the multiply blending mode, it looks very natural and real. Now I would like to try another mapping sample for you. This time I teach you the mapping design on shoes with the same instruction. Select the design with Ctrl A or Command A. Then copy the design with Ctrl C. And try to use the shortcut to become a faster. Then go to the model or shoe page and paste the design with Ctrl V and click on retransform by click on ctrl t or command t and you can resize the design until make it the appropriate scale for the shoes here we can see the 40 percent and it's selected the scale so delete the layer in the mapping page now click on quick selection tool and select the area on shoes that you need mapping your design on as explained earlier the area that we want we don't want to mapping design on by holding alt key we can remove the space Use the zoom for accurate selection as needed. Now go back to the design page and resize the design by selecting image then image size and change 100% to 40% now select all then go to the edit and copy then to the model page and select edit and paste special then select paste into Again, you select Move tool and move your design on the shoe to reach the reach to the your desired location. And again, go to the layer and change the blending mode from normal to the multiply, so you have a real realistic transform design. Thank you for watching this video, if you enjoy like it and subscribe the channel to watch new videos.